all right my people welcome back onto this channel well this is another strong one reaching us onto this one hmm, it's an exclusive one how detained nigerian central bank governor emir file implicated suspended head of anti-corruption body efcc bawa in naira redesign scam all right my people the news in details well onto this sahara reporters on wednesday night reported that the dss invited bauer to its headquarters at about 902 pm well onto this godwin emefile the suspended governor of the central bank of nigeria has identified the suspended chairman of the economic and the financial crimes commission abdul rashid bawa as an accomplice in the naira redesign scam that rocketed the country some months ago well meanwhile sarah reporters learned on thursday that a mefile who is being detained by the country's secret police the department of state services was the reason why the embattled efcc chairman was also invited and detained Sarah reporters on Wednesday night reported that the DSS invited Bar to its headquarters at about 9.02 p.m. He was therefore grilled by the operatives of the secret police. This comes after he was suspended and then indefinitely by President Bola Ahmed Tinumbu. Bauer's invitation and a grilling by the DSS came days after Emefile was arrested and then flown from Lagos to Abuja to also face interrogations over alleged corruption and an abuse of office. Sarah reporters learned that Emefile and Bauer both undergoing interrogation were being quizzed on sundry issues including the naira redesign scam on november 23 2020 then president muhammad buhari alongside mfla unveiled new naira notes in denominations of 200 naira 500 naira and 1000 naira mfla insisted that the old note would cease to be legal tender from january 31st 2023 addressing journalists after the event mfla insisted that the moves was not targeted at anyone as there were speculations that the move was pushed by the cabal in the presidency and then targeted at preventing bola Tinumbu, the presidential candidate of the ruling all progressives congress from winning the february 25th 2023 election the policy caused nigerians untold hardship due to the scarcity of naira note with the central bank of nigeria unable to meet the demand for new notes the policy led to a cash crisis and a long queues at banks and atms well onto this mfla who is currently cooling his feet in the cell of the DSS is the reason why the EFCC chairman has been detained overnight. Emefele, who is co cooperating with the DSS, claimed that Bauer was the one who raised a memo to former President Mamadou Buhari asking that the Naira should be redesigned to stem money laundering during the 2023 election a top source revealed bauer confronted him that he emefele the former attorney general of the federation malami were the ones that came to him to raise the memo because they suspected tinumbu had warehouses stuffed with naira notes the source added well, Tinumbu indefinitely suspended Bawa from office 
on Wednesday saying it would allow for a thorough investigation into his conduct while in office following weighty allegations of abuse of office against him. This was contained in a statement issued by the Director of Information Office of the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Willie Bassi, on Wednesday. Meanwhile, in February and in March, Nigerians were subjected to extreme difficulty with the Naira redesign and the cashless policy due to the scarcity of the new Naira notes. To make matter worse, MFLA had earlier refused to heed a Supreme Court ruling which made the old notes legal tender till December 31st before former President Muhammadu Buhari distanced himself from the disobedience to the court order. Meanwhile, Sarah reporters had earlier reported that Emir Fiele was suspended sequel to the ongoing investigation of his office and the planned reforms in the financial sector of the economy, according to a release by Willy Bassi, the director, information for the secretary to the government of the Federation, George Akume. Mr. Emefele has been directed to immediately hand over the affairs of his office to the Deputy Governor Operations Directorate, who will act as the central bank governor pending the conclusion of investigation and the reforms the release further said. Sarah reporters in February reported how the DSS attempted to arrest Emefele, but the chief of defense staff, General Loki Rabo, shielded him by providing soldiers to guard his residence and office. The DSS had said it intensified its investigations in order to arrest and then prosecute Emefele on allegations of terrorism, financing, and then fraud. Sarah reporters also in February reported that new court documents obtained from the DSS indicted Emefele for funding unknown government terrorizing the south southeast region of the country. DSS investigation revealed that the Apex Bank governor funded the groups with resources he raised for his failed presidential bid in 2022 and then diverted public funds. Well, my brother, my sister, this is exactly what is going on right now. Hmm. Well, DSS finally detained Emefele as he implicated also the suspended EFCC Bauer. Well, my brother, my sister, this is exactly what the people are actually the thanking God for. That, oh, this set of people actually suffered us simply because of their own selfish gain. It is only the, you know, the blood of the innocent souls that died that will deal with them. You know, a lot of people during this time, you know, had that attack, many died and all that. You know, you can imagine the kind of, you no know, state they put everyone well, according to Restail Global, it says, well, MFLA is the only one that can tell and then expose most activities of Buhari's government to his interrogation should be publicly carried out. Okay, so his interrogation should be publicly carried out. That's what he has said. Hmm. Yes, so, and then, no, a lot of comments keep coming in onto this one. Well, according to Obin, I say, well, it will be swept under the carpet. Who and who have been jailed seven under corruption charges? Well, let's see how it's going to work out. Hmm. Well, Baba God, now your hand with day. Well, majority of things onto this have been you no know, revealed. A lot of people are now like, okay, God, don't catch them. God will punish all every enemy of our souls well my brother my sister this is so strong and then i know a lot of people will be like hmm finally 
let's see how it's going to play out yes let's see how it's going to play out meanwhile let me have your own take on this one and uh, remember to subscribe for more updates if you are just joining us on this channel all right thanks and god bless